We are winning. We are winning. Stuart scores the winning goal. Here we go, back again with another match day vlog and Sunderland welcome Wigan Athletic to the Stadium of Light and their 2,000 fantastic following fans. Team, I think Lee Johnson will start with today. Bergen goal will have Doyle and Flanagan as centre-backs. Dan Neal left back, Winchester right back, Evans Loco 9 in the centre with Embel just in front, McGeady to the left, Gooch to the right and Ross Stewart up front. Good luck. Got the new Sunderland top on today. Hopefully it's a lucky top for this season. Now let's go and find Wincy. I'm here today in Wincy's Tavern and I've got Jonas with us. Jonas, how much have you missed the Sunderland matches at the Stadium of Light? Uh, a lot. Right? A lot. Yes. Are you excited today? Yeah. Are you ex super excited today? Yeah. You know, the last time we were at the game was over 488 days ago. Wow, unbelievable, wasn't it? Yeah. That's when you were a little boy, but now you're all grown up, Jonas, all grown up. What's your score prediction for the day? 3-1 uh, Sunderland. Who's going to score? Uh, McGeady, Embledon and Luke O'Neill. Are we going to win the league? Yes. At the fourth the time of asking. Yeah. And also in Wincy's Taverners cause it's Wincy, Wincy, what time is it? No. It's <laughs> uh, 3 hours. 25 past 11. 25 past 11 and we're on the beers anyway. Let's have a little yeah. toast, a little toast to the new season. Cling, cling. A new season. Cling, cling. Cling, cling, there we go. So what's the score going to be today, Wincy? 2-0 uh, to Sunderland. 2-0 to Sunderland, who's going to score? Ross Stewart and Elliot, Elliot Embleton. So Wincy, you know we've like, we haven't been to 488, over 488 I've missed, days! I've missed it. Unbelievable, isn't it? It's like half, half your lifetime gone, you half your lifetime. Tell you, don't you? I know. Are we going to get promoted this season? I hope so. You hope so. Uh -huh. What's your thoughts on the team? Do you think it's a good team? Do you think we need to strengthen? Need, definitely need to strengthen, need some more signings. And uh, we've we got no right back, no, no left, left back. back. But hopefully, Corey Let's Evans is the new, uh -huh. new captain today, isn't he? Uh -huh. See how it goes. Who's going to score today, then? And Ross Stewart. Ross Stewart. Well, you asked it before. All <laughs> oh, right. I'm on the first beer of the day and I'm already drunk. Come Happy on, days. Man, Come on, man. lads. Oh. I'm here today at the Sporties in the brand new Fan Zone Beer Garden. And we're here today with, what's your name? Lee. Lee, of course it's Lee. I knew it was Lee. I was just Lee. testing the water. <laughs> Lee, what's the score prediction today? I want to say a 2-2 two -two today. 2-2? Two 2-2? -two? Two -two. Two -two? Yeah, two -two. Who's going to score for something? McGeady. McGeady twice. McGeady twice. Uh, excited. Yes. The Come first on. time we've been in the game for absolute centuries. Yes. I say we're going to win. Come on, Alaza! Wincy, right. our top looks luminous green. Are you going to a rave, rave or something? <laughs> going to a rave. Give us a bit of rave, move. Wincy, a rave. That's it. Hey! Wincy and his raving days. Spot on. I'm here today with Normie and Wincy. Yes. Again. We're standing right behind the rubbish. Hopefully, Wigan are rubbish today. Normie, what's your score prediction? <laughs> Two want the lads. Two want the lads, who's going to score? Four. McGeady and Emerson. Own goal. Normie, what's your <laughs> thoughts on the season? Are you confident we'll get promoted this season? Not at all. Not at all, why? Yeah. Why, why? It's the squad's thinner than last season. We haven't. Set... Well, you've got to ask us after the transfer window because that, that side of the I'm stand is not good. I'm off on dinner. Come on, come on! We need to buy some more players, don't we? <laughs> oh, without doubt. That squad's not going up as it stands. What position's the main position? Up front, I would up say, front. and up front. right and left back. Exactly. Normie, hopefully we can get some sort of M victory nah, today. A, ke hope a keeper as well, because I didn't know about this Pattinson. Right. You're not and, sure where? Oh, Birch? Birch? No? Nah, he's not, he's not good enough. Hope Let's it. hope! Wigan are rubbish today and we get Let's three go. points. Come on! Sweet Luke on nine! Da, da, da. Good times never seem so good! So good! So good! So good. It's coming home! It's coming home! It's coming! Football's coming home! Well, hey! Stevie baby, what's the score going to be? 3-0. 3-0. Are you happy? I'm happy, yes. Are you happy to be back in the stadium of life? I am. I'm over, over, the the moon. Moon, over the moon, over the moon. I'm over the moon. Like being a kid again, is it? It is. It, it is. is. Aye. 3-0. I think 
our team, what we've got now is going to surprise a lot of people. We've been mourning about putting the youngsters in and finally that's what we're doing. And I think this team now is actually going to surprise them. I think we're going to wipe the floor. It's going to be 2-0 at half-time. How are you? Happy days! Enjoy the match, enjoy the match! See you, mate, see ya! David, Hi. David from Wigan. Hi. Okay, I didn't have a score prediction, but today we're just really glad that the fact we're able to be here, because uh, last season it looked like we weren't going to be. So, if football wins, then we win. Brilliant. I wish Wigan all the best in the, okay. uh, the coming season. How do you think about you think of Charlie Wake and Max Power? Uh, I, I, well, Max Power was great, great for us when we came. Yeah, it Char was funny, Charlie, yeah. Charlie White was unbelievably good for you. If he's, half, if he's half the player for us, it'll be great. Um, I'm, I, I, part of me hopes he doesn't actually score today because it oh, might be a bit okay. difficult. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Wish you all the best, mate. Okay, cheers. We'll have a great you. season. Have a great you season. Too. See you later. Good luck. Safe journey. See you in the playoffs. Yeah. Hi Terry, just a quick score prediction uh, for your vlog. Um, I'm going to go uh, Sunderland 2, Wigan 1. What about you, Kaza? Well, that's what I was going to say. Well, just say it then. I'm going to say 2-1 as well, Terry. There you go. There you go. Have a good day. See you, Terry. See, See ya. Bye-bye. On the game, Normie. Thought the value for it. Value for the money. Value for the win. Bit shaky, bit shaky at first, but we got through it. Played well. Should have went. Should have went three, three, one up. I thought I should have went. Bit harder, but like you can't argue with that because obviously. Aye. The, the new tech, like a lot of new players. They're playing together. They, they played. They played well, really. All things considered. Hopefully, with a few new additions and they get nine each other better. It'll, it'll, it'll go better, but you don't know if we should have beat Wigan. What's your thoughts on Wigan? Did they play all right? Do you think they're, uh, they're not bad? They they look like luck, considering they've got a man who scored 30 goals last exactly, season. Exactly, I know. They luck they luck the cutting edge up front as By well. Why Charlie White? You've got to put the ball on his head, haven't you? Really, because yeah, otherwise he looks uh, a little effective, nah, isn't he? Uh, on, his, on his feet, there you go. So overall, happy with three points? On your feet, lose your seat, isn't it? Right. <laughs> happy with three uh, points for the year? Oh, definitely. Definitely going 1 0 uh, down behind uh, as well, so the comeback uh, have been 2 1. Fantastic I result. said McGeady 2 1 as well. He did, he said McGeady 2 1. This lad said McGeady 2 1. The camera went off at the time. <laughs> oh, it's finished. Sunderland 2, Wigan 1. Yes, I'm half cut, walking home back from the match. And yes, it's been fantastic. Absolutely cock a hoop to get back to the games again. Yes, walking back from the match. It's been great to get back to the stadium of light. You know, meeting some good pals of mine, Pixel Rich and Mick. And we have, you know, Wincy Jonas and Lee on and his family on the bus, you know, giving good score predictions and also, as you've just seen, a good sort of match review from Dormy. Down the rain now. Thought it was a good game. Gooch, Gooch had a really good game. I would probably give Gooch man of the match today. Really good performance, 110% from the whole bunch of lads. We had Winchester as an unorthodox right back. We had Neil as an unorthodox left back. So, you know, we do need one or two players to come in still to bolster the squad, to give us a strong look about the squad. You know, so we need to bring sort of 
I know the striker, possibly to help Stewart. Will Green looked happy on the bench today. <laughs> well done to the Wigan fans. 2,000 Wigan fans come to the stadium like today. You know, I hope you'll have a safe journey home and good luck to the future uh, in, in League One. Wigan fans, you know, you're going to have a hard time of it. And I you know I do wish Max Power and Charlie White all the best and Jordan Jones, but. Sunderland A team beat the Sunderland B team 2-1 today at the Stadium of Light and I do wish all the Wigan fans a safe travel home. 2,000 fans, absolutely fantastic Wigan fans, you know, did your team proud today, you just weren't good enough. I thought Sunderland, you know, threw out the most created, the most clear cut chances and Wigan only created one or two little sniffs, they did get the goal but I thought Sunderland deserved the victory today. We are winning, we are winning. Stuart scores the winning goal. We are winning, beating Wigan, and now I'm happy going home. A nice warm down after the match. A quick two mile run home, almost back home. Get me tea on, get the pint out the fridge. And then we'll do a quick match review. Wake up League One, I think we've got something to say to you. It was early in August and the kids weren't even back at school. We went to goal behind and then Stuart scored an extra time. No, he never. He scored in 53 minutes to take the winning goal, Ross Rod Stewart. Gets his first goal of the league campaign of the season and Sunderland win 2-1. Gonna celebrate, gonna toast the victory 2-1 against Wigan. Yes, Wigan, yes, we're in League One, but we are happy we haven't been at a football match for 488 days. Yes, 488 days. Today we're finally back and the fans voiced their opinion, cheered on the lads. Well done, KLD. Lee Johnson and the team today winning 2-1, it was a difficult game, Wigan played well early doors, went a goal in front and then Sunderland justly deserved a penalty, Aidan McGeady slotted the ball home and then second half Stewart scored to make it 2-1, Stewart could have scored again to get a brace to make it 3-1 but we saw out the game and we took a victory just like we did in the first time we played in League 1 in this sort of run of League 1 fixtures against Charlton and Ros when another Ross, yes, Ross the boss, I forget the second name, <laughs> he was in charge of Sunderland when we beat Charlton 2-1. So we're going to do a toast, toast to the lads, toast to the fans, toast to the away Wigan fans. I hope you make it home safe and sound because at the end of the day you have lost, you won't be very happy. But, you know, your team will take a little bit of time to gel together. Wigan may be better in the future as the season goes on. Cracking open the first beer of the day. <laughs> yeah, so it's great to be back at the ground again. Seeing all your old friends from, you know, days gone by. Back in the olden days. The last game I saw was Gillingham 2. Sunday 2. Sunday 2. Gillingham 2 was the last game I seen. So cheers to everybody out there. Cheers to all the Sunday fans. Cheers to all my good mates at the ground today. Ah, it was just great to be back at the Stadium of Light. Ah, oh, I need that after that run home. Team news today? Well, it was what I said on the Sunday bunch, no, the Thursday night bunch, and also my match preview. That was the team I wrote down. That was the score prediction I did. Man of the match? I'm going to give it to, oh it's close, I think Gooch had a really good game today, Gooch had a good game, I thought Stewart looked really effective up, up front, and I thought, you know, you've got, you've got, you've got, to, you've got to give praise to Dan Neal and, and, and Carl Winchester playing out of position, it's not always easy playing out of position, ask Luke 09. But we won 2-1. What else can I say? Thanks for watching the video. Please subscribe to the channel. I will be doing a live stream for the Port Vale match during the week on Tuesday night away in the Carabao Cup. 
So we'll see you then. Thanks for supporting the channel. Thanks for getting us over 11,000 subscribers. It is fantastic, the support I've got on this channel. All of you lot have made the channel, not me. You made the channel. Thanks again. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Take care. God bless. I'm here. Go, go with you. And we'll see you on Tuesday night. Get in. Open and victory. Starting game of the season. Happy days. <laughs> Sunday, Monday, happy days. Tuesday, Wednesday, happy days. Thursday, Friday, happy days. Saturday, what a day. Getting three points for you. Get in.